out in droves. And we just had a fabulous time. Trick or treating creates lifelong memories. We moved in here the summer of 68, and back in the day when I was trick or treating, we had a lot. That's Leslie Fody, whose family has lived in Ballard's Olympic Manor neighborhood for decades. She says Halloween is one of her favorite holidays, and it shows with the countless decorations outside her family's home. But she feels there's been less holiday spirit as of late. Sadly, I am seeing a decrease in the number of kids that go out, and the ones that do are generally accompanied by their parents. I totally understand that. She believes the decrease is because what she says is an increase in crime. In the past week, King 5 has reported about groups destroying Halloween decorations in South King County. In at least 14 instances of teens in North Seattle targeted in muggings in September. I think with what's going on in Ballard with these gangs going around, um, it's scaring people. Despite those concerns, just three blocks away, one mother is planning on getting out with her family Halloween night. Of course, I have heard things, but it hasn't dissuaded my husband or I. I think we feel comfortable because we will be with our kids. Um, but no, we will be out there 100%. She says she still sees hundreds of trick or treaters along her street and believes it's a tradition that will never go away. It's great for the kids to be able to express themselves in costumes. They get excited um, for us to also dress up. So it's just a fun family activity. Reporting in Seattle, Brady Wakayama, King 5 News.